decriminalization of COVID-19 protocol breaches. In a national address on Wednesday, 11th August 2021, the Prime Minister, Honorable Philip J. Pierre, announced that COVID-19 protocol breaches will be decriminalized. This law will be repealed at a sitting of Parliament, the highest lawmaking body in the state. To date, there has been no sitting of Parliament, and as such, breaches of COVID-19 protocols are still a criminal offence and punishable by law. Honorable Pierre further explained that persons who had previously arrested, charged, convicted for COVID-19 protocol breaches will have their records expunged. An appeal was made to persuade and encourage citizens to comply with the protocol guidelines instead of inflicting threats and punishment. The Prime Minister intimated that he understood the struggle of many who have been called to do what does not come naturally to them. And so, there must be compassion and empathy. Together, let us recommit as a nation with a steadfast resolve to observe the regular washing and sanitizing of hands, social, social distancing, the wearing of masks in public spaces, and the avoidance of large crowd events. To those still hesitant about taking the vaccine, we ask you to reconsider your position. Seek medical advice and help protect our nation from this deadly virus by taking the vaccine. Together, we can do this. Let us do it for the good benefit of ourselves and our country. The adjusted COVID-19 protocols are in effect from 13th to the 31st August 2021 in order to mitigate the threat levels to the people of St. Lucia. The COVID-19 protocols are explained and available on all social media platforms of the government of St. Lucia. However, the public is encouraged to use the hotline number 311 if they have any queries or concerns.